In this weather, they'd be vulnerable. And so I did that. I ran about 31, 30, and I was just hoping that one of them could run their PR in this heat. With that being said, some of them are a lot fitter than their PR, but I just looked at strategically on the paper and I said if I can go run 31.15 to 31.30, I had a chance of just having one an off day in the heat. But I predicted it to a T. I said with about a mile to go, there'd be four of us, and there was. And um, I just tried to stay, stay tough and try to change gears and hopefully fake my way. Like, you know, believe it and you'll become it kind of thing. But I mean, they're track athletes and um, I haven't been on the track in a while and so they just have those years and this would constitute, if I would call this a workout, this would be like number 10 since my comeback with my injury. So I'm massively underprepared, but I um, was just hoping that but the basically 70. all my strength from the 12 to 13 years would come into play and just being tough and trying to be gritty out there but you know training you know you get exposed when you don't do the training and you haven't done it quite yet but the 75s were comfortable yeah i got in a good groove and a few 77s in there i would slip it's like i would fall into my marathon almost pace like a comfortableness and i had to remind myself like it's supposed to be uncomfortable so yeah would you say this is the least prepared you've been for Oh, this is the least prepared I've ever been for a race, ever. Um, but I think it's important to still show up, even when you are unprepared sometimes. I think it's as part of the job. You know, sometimes you guys show up and you're not maybe on your A game, right? Where you lack of sleep or something going on. And I think it's still important to still show up and do your job, even if you aren't totally prepared. And um, I have big aspirations for the fall, and I just feel like this is a great way to get my competitive spirit back. And, with the marathoning, I don't race a lot, and I think it's important to sharpen those skills that I haven't been doing for a long time. So, first time. Um, I'm really proud of that, and I was hoping I wouldn't end the streak tonight, but I knew there's a possibility. I am 35. I'm turning 36 July 8th, so it's, it's inevitable, right? But um, it makes me appreciate when I do make those teams for sure. It's like I kind of started to take them for granted. Like, oh, I'm definitely. Gonna, I would go into the race knowing. Not worrying about making the team, but be worrying about winning, and that's a different mindset. Tonight, third was going to be a phenomenal feeling if I could do that. So.